What's up everybody? It's your boy Meme here. I've got the void right next to me. Um, today for breakfast I had a... I don't think I had anything for breakfast, but for lunch I had some sandwiches, a couple sandwiches. And uh, for dinner we had um, some, some bean burritos and they were good. Uh, this isn't actually the void next to me. Uh, this is just like my webcam cover, half, half covering up my webcam. <laughs> I thought that'd be funny to say at the beginning of a video. Um, you know, these past couple videos have been so long, um, and, you know, I have nothing else to talk about. I, I swear I do, I swear I do have things to talk about, but I forgot what they were. Um, so yeah, I work five days in a row, starting tomorrow, so that'll be, uh, fine, I guess. I mean, I, I, I don't mind me getting money, but, um, you know, I also got paid in five days, which is cool. I don't know. Um, you know, I'm kind of specking out the NAS server I'm going to buy, and like, man, you know, like, NAS servers are expensive. Why do they cost so much? <laughs> Man, especially if you want to do like flex encoding and stuff. And this isn't even including the hard drives, okay? This is this is just like hardware. Um, including the hard drives, this will be like silly expensive. But uh, yeah, and then once I do that and I have all of my actual stuff on a computer, then I can have a nice lean gaming machine with like four terabytes of storage and that's it. And it's on like an SSD and it'll be like fast, you know? Uh, but yeah, for real. Um, yeah. Okay. Plan right now. Okay, car is kind of in the background. I've got a car at some point. But first priority, NAS server, right? Um, I can spend lots of money on a NAS server so then I can actually store things. Um, I have, I don't know, I think 20 terabytes, which is a, one terabyte is a thousand gigabytes, right? I, I think I have around tw 20 terabytes connected to my computer. Um, and it's annoying because it's all in like these separate little hard drives and SSDs and I just have a bunch of things connected to my computer and it's horrible. And I really want a central place to put all of it. Not only that, I want to be able to have my storage anywhere I go. So if I'm on my computer or if I'm at school, I want to be able to access my stuff anywhere, right? Uh, and another thing is I want to be able to download YouTube videos for real. Um, I have this YouTube channel collection that's um, a little under 8 terabytes and it's um, uh, I have this horrible issue where I try to download from YouTube, and I don't know if I'm being throttled or if YouTube is throttling me or something, uh, but whenever I'm trying to download a video, it just goes down to like 10 kilobits a second, it's like, oh, it takes like 23 hours to download a video when I'm watching a YouTube video right now at like 4K and it's fine. So I don't know what the issue is with that, uh, but what I do know is that um, if I hook it up through Ethernet, I'll know definitely it's an issue with YouTube if I'm still throttling. I don't think that'll be an issue though. I, I don't think I will be throttling. If I'm hooked up through Ethernet and downloading videos there, it'll be fine. Um, and also, um, then I can just like build a computer, like a computer computer without like a bunch of stupid little hard drives to keep all of my storage in them. So that'll be nice. Um, I've kind of dug myself into a hole and the only way I can get myself out of it is by spending lots of money on a little NAS server. Uh, but you know, what can you do, I suppose? Uh, yeah. Alright, see you dude. It's 9.54 at night. I'm tired.